Alchemy Goods started eight years ago when my messenger bag was stolen. Instead of buying a new bag, I decided to fashion one myself from materials I had lying around my house. And being a cyclist, I had a bunch of bike tubes lying around. I cut them open, stitched them together, and made my very first bag, which was this one right here. So when I made the first bag, I didn't really plan to start a business, but my friends started asking me to make bags for them. So I collected some tubes at local bike shops and started fashioning bags and it spread like wildfire. Their friends asked for more bags, and after a year, I quit my day job and started Alchemy Goods. We started out selling locally, but we've grown to sell nationwide. We have about 350 retailers that we sell to across the country. Alchemy is the medieval science of turning lead into gold. Here, we turn trash into treasure. We transform um, refuse into durable, beautiful products. We collect bike tubes at bike shops um, all across the country. Uh, local bike shops, when they change someone's flat, they'll take those tubes and put them into a recycling receptacle. Bicycling's super green, and what do you do with the big black spot on it? All those tubes, there's a lot of tubes left over, and Alchemy Goods partners with us, and we get rid of one of the worst parts of cycling, which is a whole lot of leftover rubber, and they turn it into really cool stuff. Most people don't know that tubes are recyclable but Alchemy Goods has really made that happen. Independent bike shops work with us. Uh, we also have two really large partnerships, one with REI and another with Trek Bicycles. As we've grown, we've grown our collection network to cover the entire country, and we now have about 600 bike shops that collect tubes for us, and they're committed suppliers of bike tubes for our production process. We try and use the entire inner tube, so the largest pieces we use for bags we use the small pieces for wallets, and then what's left over is just that valve stem from the tube, which we turn into a zipper pull, just like this. We now use a seat belt uh, as the straps on our bags. You can see that on this bag, and we also use vinyl. This is a billboard material that's colorful and durable. We don't want people to throw out bike tubes for two reasons. One, because of the environmental impact, but two, because it's a really valuable material. It's beautiful, it's waterproof, it has a wonderful history to it, and we can take those materials and turn them into wallets, into bags, into belts, and all sorts of things. The great thing about upcycling is that it contributes jobs to our local economy, it saves waste from the landfill, and allows us to create really fantastic products along the way. We've collected 400,000 used bike inner tubes to date, but we really want to collect more and we want your help. We're gonna try and collect one million bike tubes by the end of 2014, so send them our way.